Hello and welcome back to Stocking Fillers. It is Christmas Eve, it is the 24th of December, it is the 24th episode of Stocking Fillers, and today we have somebody who, he's, he's, he's very strange, and I don't mean that in a personal sense, I mean his attributes are very, very strange. You'll see it in a second by what I mean. It is 30 year old Bissau Guinea, or Guinea Bissau, I'm not quite sure what way round it is said, central defender slash defence midfielder Eddie Gomez. Now you can see his, uh, his, his attributes here. He's got a lot of greens. He's also got a lot of white ones as well. Technically 16 heading, 17 long throws, 16 tackling. That's actually pretty good for a central defender. Mentally, 19 bravery, 16 work rate. Two very useful stats. Physically, this man is a machine. He is a brick wall. 16 balance, 18 jump reach, 16 natural fitness, 17 pace, 17 strength. To top it all off, the guy is six foot five. If you if you include all of these stats together, he's six foot five. His jumping reach is 18. His heading is 16. I don't know how the whole match engine works, but I imagine he can header the ball from 46 feet in the air. Now I need to make this aware now, this list is not best players, this is by no means a list of the best players available on free transfers, Eddie Gomez is an example of someone who I found and went, that's, it, it's surreal, it's surreal. And weirdly, he's not terrible in terms of his actual abilities, we'll get to that in a minute. Looking at his career as well, he's, uh, he's spent a lot of time in China. And he actually went for a big sum of money, I say a big sum of money, a million pounds. A million pounds from a team in Denmark is actually, that's that's a huge profit for Esbjerg there. He's also got one cap and one goal to his name as well for Bisu Guinea, or Guinea Bisu. I've always called it Guinea Bisu, it is Guinea Bisu. Yes, he's got one cap to his name and one goal. He's also, apparently, the fifth top player for Guinea Bisu. And it gets even better. If you are playing in England and you want yourself an absolute unit at the back of Eddie Gomez, you don't need to even need a work permit for him. He's part Danish, so he can come through, no work permit at all, doesn't need to have played 56 games for Guinea Bissau. He's available to play straight away. In terms of leagues that I think he'll be competent in, now this is probably me being optimistic, but I think he'll do a job in the championship. I think he'll do a job at the top end of the championship as well. Probably not week in, week out. You wouldn't want him as your main central defender. If you're the low end of the championship, then maybe you would want that. If you can get him at League One, I think he's going to be an absolute unit and he's going to just stop anyone. Like him defending corners. No one's ever going to score a corner against you with a guy whose heading is 16, he's 6 foot 5, and he can jump 18 feet in the air. In terms of his hidden attributes, this is where it kind of gets interesting as well. 122 is his current ability, which isn't awful. 120 to 130, I'd say, is a reasonable level championship player. His potential ability is 129. Obviously, he's nearly 30 years old, will be 30 years old by the end of the year. He's not really going to improve too much, but let's be honest, what was he going to improve? He's not going to get better at heading, or long throws, or tackling. Or he's not going to get stronger, and if he does, that's just bloody ridiculous. Obviously, he does lack a few key mental attributes, uh, composure, concentration, probably need to be a bit higher off the wall of five not the best vision of six not the best maybe if you play three central defenders eddie gomez should be the one in the middle who doesn't have to do a lot and you have two ball playing defenders either side of him maybe that's what you do with eddie also in order to get eddie gomez into your database i think you need to have uh, potentially the danish background players on or maybe even background players from guinea bissau or possibly players who from china i'm not quite sure He's not on the normal standard database, so you need to kind of load up some additional leagues in order to get him. I've just noticed as well, he's got some player traits. He marks his opponent tightly. He's got 15 marking, that's also pretty good. Dives into tackles, possesses a long, flat throw. Of course he does, he's got 17 long throws. Anyway, that is going to do it for this episode of Stocking Fillers. For Christmas Eve, it is Eddie Gomez, the Guinea Bissau at central defender, with one cap and one goal to his name. And I would love to sign this man. I really want to sign this man for like a really obscure team as well. I'm probably going to try and do that. Thank you very much for watching. If you did enjoy this episode, do remember to leave a like. If you want to see more, hit the subscribe button and I'll be back tomorrow with the final entrant in our stocking fillers list.